her some stages in Denver for two years, but really she just wants to be a mermaid, you know? It's typical, typical teenager, right? Lauren DeVoe, everyone, let's give it up. I'm just going to be a mermaid. I do. Everyone wants to be a mermaid. Okay, just me. No. I'm a comedian, I'm also an aspiring actress. I tried really hard, and I had an audition the other week. I did. I killed that audition. Killed it. Killed any chance of getting that role. <laughs> Completely no chance. Uh, I swam for a very long time. My dream was to be an Olympic swimmer. As you can see, I have failed. <laughs> I had AD me as a kid, and my mom took me to the doctor, and she's like, what do I do with her? And the doctor said, put her in something that will help her focus. Because nothing helps you focus more than trying not to drown. <laughs> Uh, for example, here, I'll tell you a secret about swimming. It's a very weird sport. Secret. Every single pool you've swam in, a beat in. <laughs> yeah. It's like a territory thing. It's like, that pool is mine, and that pool is also mine, and that pool is not mine. And there's cock in it. <laughs> Man. Um, Has anyone heard of swim cest? Has anyone heard of swim cest? No. no. Okay, I'll let you know what it is. It's when a swimmer gets with another swimmer. I'll leave it there. Uh, did you know when two swimmers get together, they actually have a baby minnow? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, and so I swam so much that chlorine was my perfume. The only people that wanted to date me were janitors. And murderers. <laughs> murderers. Although my hopes and dreams were dead the whole time. That was the dark one. I'll move on. <laughs> yeah, my mom got me into swimming, like I said. Uh, my mom's name is Dorothy. And when she gets mad, we call her Darth Vader. <laughs> she'll just, she'll come run in the room mad at my dad, and we'll just hear, <laughs> Lauren. <laughs> I hate your father. She's a great woman. She's a, she's a, yeah. When I was nine years old, I remember I was on the couch singing Little Mermaid because obviously, right? And I'm singing, and I look at my mom. I go, Mom, am I a good singer? And she looks at me and she goes, mm, You're more of a backup singer. <laughs> Thanks, Mom. Thanks, Dorothy. Yeah. No. I looked in the mirror the other day, I did, I, I looked like her, I saw her, and I was like, oh no! So I cut my hair, I cleaned the house, and I got 50% of the divorce. 50% of the divorce. Uh, she really shakes my confidence, my mom, she does. Everyone's got confidence, we were all human, right? we got confidence issues. Uh, a little vo a voice in the back of your head, doubt. Like, I'll do my power pose, I'll look in the mirror, I'll be like, Lauren, you're a star! That little voice is like, stars burn out. <laughs> I, was like, uh, I did have a lot of confidence in college, though. I did. I used to go to the club. I, yeah, I the club. I used to whip my hair so hard, just like, yeah, look, look at that. I did that one time so hard, someone next to me just was like, hey, girl, your hair smells great. What kind of shampoo do you use? And I'm like, thanks. It's called buy me a drink, but I'm not going to sleep with you. Yeah. I, I, I have, I'm in a relationship now, he's a, he's a, he's a good fella, but um, I, uh, growing up I actually didn't have money, I just wanted to travel, so I just dated the exchange students. <laughs> <laughs> the exchange students. It always worked out, but I, until I had to spend money on language lessons, but now I know how to say I love you in two languages, and why is your thing crooked in one? So, <laughs> see? Um, yeah, I, relationships are hard though. You get into fights, you know, with, with them. I'm bad at flirting in relationships. I'm really bad at flirting. Some, someone texts me, you know that morning text, good morning. He continued with it. He goes, when I wake up in the morning, I like to do sit-ups and push-ups to get my day going. Yeah, and I respond, yeah, well, when I wake up in the morning, I slide off my bed like a snake because my legs don't work yet. <laughs> he dated me. He's the real winner. I'm telling you that. But... Our very last conversation we had, he, he told me, he talked to me, he goes, 
Good luck with your career and your depression. <laughs> Whoa. It's like you didn't know I was a stand-up comedian. <laughs> Thank you guys so much. My name's Lauren. You guys are awesome.